UND St. John, a new art exhibit called sure. Natural Fragments is about to open with a very unique style. Fabiola Martinez paints with pigments derived from a small, crushed up insect. She's taken the material from her home in Mexico and blended it with materials from here in the Maritimes. The CBC's Matthew Bingley has that story. For 10 years, Fabiola Martinez hung on to a gift from her uncle, small, dried out insects called cochineal. Traditionally used in her native Mexico to dye textiles and food, she decided to use them to paint. The color, the pigment, comes from the muscle tissues. So once it dries, you can use the pigment to be used as a dye. For years, Martinez didn't feel ready to paint with the cochineal. The pigment produces only one color and she was uncertain if she could properly manipulate it. But she remained drawn to the color red. By me using the cochinella with the red color is the interpretation of my roots. So I wanted to explore more about where I can find this color without manipulating it. Using slabs of maple wood from New Brunswick as her canvas, Martinez added textures using other natural materials. Everything from rose petals to sand gathered from the Monument Valley Desert in Arizona and Prince Edward Island. Since when you are thinking about red, then you are just looking for the red. And the red can be everywhere. So that's, yeah, that was amazing to, to find out that the, the, the red from the, from the Monument Valley is so nice and bright. And then you go to PEI and you have it there with different texture, but it's red too. Martinez hopes that when people see her art, they will be reminded of their connection to the planet, even if at the moment it happens to be buried in snow. Matthew Bingley, CBC News, St. John. Well-known sports writer who worked out of Halifax has died.